Hi everyone, I'm Sebastian from The Decorum. Today I'm gonna teach you guys how to make a drink at home because we know that these days you can't really go out anymore, bars are closed, um, it's a little bit sad but you, you still can, can have a good drink at home and I'm gonna teach you how to do it. First of all, which drink? I'm gonna teach you how to make the boulevardier. What is a boulevardier? It's a twist on a Negroni. Everyone knows a Negroni. It's a bittersweet cocktail, classic cocktail, gin, Campari, sweet vermouth. But we're gonna make a classic twist on it using whiskey instead. So let's see the ingredients that you need. Very easy, very little ingredients and very little um, ustensils. So I'm gonna teach you how to make a boulevardier, which is a classic cocktail. A uh, twist on a Negroni, a very famous cocktail. Uh, but instead of using gin, I'm gonna use whiskey. I decided to choose rye, rye whiskey because uh, its flavor profile is more spicy, is more dry. It's a good counterbalance to the other part of this cocktail that I'm gonna explain now. The other ingredient is Campari, quite a famous Italian Amaro. What is an Amaro is a spirit uh, that has some sweetness and some bitterness as well. Bitterness comes from different ingredients such as orange skin, different citrus skin and some spices as well. The last liquid ingredient would be sweet vermouth. Uh, what is sweet vermouth? That's what you call fortified wine, where you would take some scraps of wine and people would add some um, different flavoring agents to it, roots, citrus, and uh, sweet agents to it. And that is sweet vermouth. Another very important ingredient is the ice. Uh, good cold ice, very clear ice. The clearer, the better. You can get those anywhere in supermarkets, even 7-Eleven. I would use orange as a garnish. Not the whole orange, but only the, the skin of it. I'm gonna teach you how to cut the skin properly as well. Tools, you don't need many tools for this cocktail, it's very easy, you can make it at home. Uh, you just need a, a glass. I would recommend a rocks glass because you would drink a boulevardier in a rocks glass. But you can drink it in a stem glass as well, it's very nice. Uh, you need a, a spoon, it doesn't need to be a bar spoon like this, it can be the regular spoon that you have. You need a knife to cut the orange skin, you need a cutting board and that's it. First of all, you want to chill your glass because it's a cocktail that you want to drink cool. So you put the ice in the glass. It's gonna melt a little bit before you're done with your drink, so it's okay if the ice goes above the rim of the glass. There you go. Chill it a little bit. Very important, you put the excess of water away. And now I'm gonna add the different ingredients to it. Um, 30 to 35 ml of whiskey. 15 to 20 ml of Campari, up to taste. The more the sweeter, the more bitter, the more complex. And uh, 15 to 20 ml again of sweet vermouth. And then you want to stir the drink quite well, like maybe 20 seconds, something like that. You want to get the drink ice cold and you want to get the drink well diluted. It's going to make it easier and more enjoyable as well because if you don't stir it enough, you're going to get um, the kick of the alcohol may be too strong for you. There you go, the drink is ready. Now I'm gonna teach you how to cut the orange peel to get a nice garnish to it. You cut the bottom, you cut the head, you let the orange like this, turn it 45 degrees, and then you cut it, just the skin. From bottom to head. And you get the nice peel like this. You can cut it if you wanna have it nicer. Cut the rim out. And then the important part is to express the oil. So you go close to your glass and you press it. You can twist it. And then you put it in your drink. And there you go. That's a Boulevardier. There you go. Thank you for watching us. Uh, I hope you appreciate your drink, your own drink that you're gonna make by yourself now. And uh, please, you're welcome at the Decorum anytime we open every day. And uh, instead of talking about garments, we can talk about drinks as well. We have a little selection, but don't tell anyone. See you guys soon, bye.